Okay, Real Dig, I'm here to show you how to wrap your hands, okay? You can call this more of a pro style type wrap. Um, it's not a conventional way that you might see other construction, but I do like it because it gives you an open palm, which during actual events, it's how they want you to wrap your hands. You gotta have an open palm, otherwise it's not qualified. Um, so when you're training, it's important to wrap your hands. It helps support the wrist. You know, it just, just protect your hands. Okay, y'all, so it's important when you wrap, not, not to tweak your wrist, whether it's here, you, you, you know, you, you, want, you want your wrist straight, you don't want it like this as you're wrapping or up like this. You want it straight and secure the whole time you're wrapping, okay? You don't want to twist it that way or that way while you're wrapping because it's it's like a cast. And you want to, you want to hold that position to where your wrist is straight. It, it reduces injury, okay? So what I like to do, start from the top of the hand under the wrist, okay? Now, depending on the size of the hand is, is what I determine how many times I might wrap, whether it's around the wrist or around the fist, okay? Might be more, might be less, depending on the size of the hand. So I'll go make sure my wrist is firm and straight. I'll go maybe three times, okay? And then you go top of the hand from the wrist, okay, under the hand. And when you go across the knuckles, okay, you want the bottom of the wrap right up, right above these knuckles, okay? See that? These knuckles here, all right? So when you go around the knuckles, you know, I'll go five, six times, depending on the size of the hand, okay? All right? So, uh, you know, open hand, okay? And then you go close it to go back under the wrist, across the top of the hand, under the wrist, okay? Top of the hand, okay? Then you're gonna go across the bottom of the hand, okay? and up to that finger, okay? All right, make a fist. You're gonna go under the wrist, back to the top of the hand, and you're gonna go up through the middle finger, okay? Just make a fist. Make sure your wrist is straight under the hand. Well, I'm gonna go, go across the other way. Okay. So I went back the other way, under the wrist with the fist. Make sure your wrist is straight. Okay. Top of the hand, you're gonna cross under the hand all the way over to the other side. Okay, through that finger, if you can see that. Okay, back the other way. And then from here, I make a thumb. And you can go around the thumb. Okay, just like so. Now here, I go all, I wrap all the way around till I come out to the bottom at the wrist. Okay, and I go under the wrist. Okay, I like to hit the thumb twice. So I'll do it again. Okay, all the way around to the bottom of your wrist. All right, and there you have the thumb. Okay, make sure it's as tight as you want it, where it's comfortable, not too tight, but tight enough to secure. So you open the hand. What I like to do at the end is go all the way across the hand. Okay, all the way across. And I crisscross at the top of the hand. 
And there you have it. Boom. Then I'll finish up on the wrist. Okay, with whatever's left. And there you have it. And you see the open palm. Okay, and this gives you something to fill up your hand. Okay, open palm, and that's that's a pro style wrap if you want to call it that. But it's an open palm, gives you a good, hard, solid fist. Okay, the important thing is keeping that wrist straight. All right, thank you for watching. Safety first.